I am the motographer. In 2019, I embarked on the journey of a lifetime on the fantastic Indian-made Bajaj Dominar 400s, christened as the XBB Dominar Creation Odyssey. The road trip went from New Delhi, Nepal, Bhutan, Myanmar, Thailand, Laos, Vietnam, Cambodia, Malaysia, and finally to the tip of Singapore and beyond to Sri Lanka. Here we go. So we've reached our destination for the day, the Eternity Resort. Yeah, Eternity Resort. Okay, IT please. Before doing diary, first do the face. Look, what's going on from the face? Oh, God. Look, it was white. Thai, white. White. Right now at Golden, at Golden Rock, which is one of the holiest sites for uh, Buddhists around the world, it is said that there's a huge rock, golden color rock, which is, uh, uh, you know, sitting on, on the edge of a mountain. And they said that it's, uh, you know, balancing on the hair of, uh, on, on a hair thread of uh, Buddha. So a lot of uh, pilgrims, uh, Buddhists, uh, pilgrims here come here. You know, every day and uh, a lot of tourists you'll see all around. So the day begins. Today is a big day. We will be entering into country number five, which is Thailand. Today we are starting from Golden Rock, which is a famous pilgrimage site. Unfortunately, we didn't have time to visit the rock itself, but we uh, stayed right at the base of it. It was just a... Uh, 20 minutes ride from here so that is the entry gate this road this one uh, goes to the golden rock and uh, but as I said we did not have enough time unfortunately in our hands to visit it it will take at least a couple of hours and we do not have those couple of hours with us unfortunately okay why is the cleaning time <laughs> yeah, I'm asking, boy. School, going to ready. <laughs> so this is the market at the Golden Rock, like any other tourist place or a religious tourist place in India. We find a lot of shops selling souvenirs, uh, statues, and things like that. And the road is amazing. Hai. It is like a racetrack. Doesn't, that doesn't mean that you should race on it, but it just feels like one. A short break to tell you about myself. In 2002, I founded XBHP, which is India's most popular motorcycling platform and print magazine. Since 2006, I have been riding around the world on choices of the motorcycles and supercars. Do check out the XBHP forums, which are a great place to discover fantastic information on motorcycling in India. Also help us sustain ourselves by picking up a copy of the XPHP print magazine delivered to you at your doorstep if you are in India or available at one of the premium bookstalls around India. You can also read the digital version online. The link is in the description below. 
Now let's get back to the Odyssey. So we are progressing towards the border of Myanmar and Thailand. And this road is going to be very bad very soon. But let's enjoy while we can. Small Burmese village feels like we are somewhere in South India, like Tamil Nadu or uh, and talking about India, we found one Bajaj auto. And surprisingly, Bajaj is the only Indian brand that is so prominently visible everywhere in Myanmar. I haven't seen any other Indian brand be it anything, you know, like FMCG or a automotive brand and I'm not saying this because Bajaj is our sponsor but this is a fact because Myanmar is a closed economy quite a closed economy and uh, they haven't allowed uh, the manufacturers from around the world to set up their shop you won't find many familiar brands here except Coke Pepsi and things like that. So finding Bajaj, uh, so finding Bajaj motorcycles, auto rickshaws, everywhere in Myanmar is a very pleasant feeling. Oh, oh. this one South Indian style temple here. which tells us that there are lots of uh, South Indian living here and especially Tamils. So there is very strong crosswind here and uh, it's very difficult to keep the bike straight. It is taking a lot of effort to keep the bike straight it is going sideways, like it is tilted, like this. Very strong crosswind, very strong. यहाँ से होता है ऑफरोडिंग शुरू रोड खत्म हो चुका है लगभग 70 से 80 किलोमीटर है उसके बाद आएगा थाईलैंड का बॉर्डर एंड एक बात माननी पड़ेगी इस बाइक की यार अमेजिंग बाइक मतलब मुझे ऐसा लग रहा था कि टूरिंग थोड़ा सा कंफर्टेबल नहीं होगा इस बाइक पे लेकिन टूरिंग एकदम कंफर्टेबल है और अगर ये जुगाड़ कर लिया जाए टॉप बॉक्स और पैनियर का तो लाइफ झिंगा लाला इसमें सिर्फ एक दिक्कत है विंड स्क्रीन का यहाँ पर बहुत ज़्यादा हवाएं चल रही है और वो ऐसा छाती पे लग रहा था तो फील होता है बाकी बाइक एकदम टकाटक है अभी तक का जो राइड का एक्सपीरियंस रहा मस्त मज़ा आया मतलब तीन घंटा सो के भी नींद नहीं आ रही है इट सीम्स दैट द रोड इज टर्निंग इन टू डस्ट Oh my god and it's getting red as the soil replaces the tarmac slowly but surely uh, 50 kilometers <clears throat> of this kind of road I mean worse than this I believe is still left bloody hell look at this wildest imaginations and I just hope that it is not wet because if it is wet then it's going to be very slippery ah, this is where the need of four tires is uh, often understood I have to get back up on the road now 
Oh, if you can call that a road. Yes, that is a road. Bloody hell. Yes, amazing. Oh, here we go. Oh, shit. Holy hell. Oh. <coughs> shit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mazadar off road ke baad. धूले तूफान राइड के बाद पहुंचे हैं यहाँ पर इनकी हालत मैंने कहा कि अंदर घुसने से पहले आप दिखा दोगे कैसे दिख रहे हो आई फील लाइक वन द टकार रैली नेक्स्ट फिफ्टी किलोमीटर्स इट्स गोइंग टू बी कम्प्लीटली ऑफ रोड एंड मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंटली इट्स गोइंग टू बी रेड लाल मिट्टी लाल मिट्टी होगी मेरे मेरे देश की नहीं लेकिन लाल मिट्टी है अरे टोटल हमने गाड़ी चलाई है आज 209 किलोमीटर गाड़ी चलाई है हमने और 209 किलोमीटर के बाद लिया गया लंच ब्रेक खाना ज़रूरी है अदरवाइज बैगन खा के दिखाओ ना अरे बाप एक बार ट्राई तो करो वो टॉर्चर कम है जो ये एक बार टॉर्चर है एक बार ऐसे चबा कर तो देखो कैसे लग रहा है इट्स केम इन सैलेड आर वी सपोज्ड टू ईट इट इंडिया मा फूड इट्स कम्स अलोंग विद द साइड डिश यू हैव टू ईट विद द फिश पेस्ट ओके इट्स कम्स अलोंग अच्छा भाई देखो ये खा सकते हैं बट इसको यू आर सपोज्ड टू ईट इट विद फिश पेस्ट ठीक है तो मैं फिश तो खा नहीं सकता तो मैं ये भी नहीं खाऊंगा ये तो मीठा है <laughs> this nightmare of a road continued for about 60 kilometers, and it just drained us of every ounce of energy that we had. But when it ended, it gave way to one of the most beautiful roads we had seen so far. Thirty kilometers before the Thailand border, and how the fortunes of this road have changed. Look at this. Second Myanmar Thai Friendship Bridge. You can see it in over there. So this is the town of Meawadi in uh, Myanmar, and uh, for 300 meters from here is the cross border crossing station that you have to use to get over to Thailand. And I guess that is it over there. Now here is where the paperwork will start, and uh, we have to park here and wait for the escort to do their duties. So across that bridge over there is Thailand. Border here, yeah? Border. Yes. Denmark. Across that is Thailand. Paperwork 
here filling all the immigration details and uh, that's funny Salim okay So behind me is immigration. This is the first time I'm coming into Thailand via land. Uh, it's a little weird to see uh, doing all this in a land port. All right, let's go inside. So we have got the exit stamp on our passports from Myanmar, and we are officially out of Myanmar. The only thing remaining from Myanmar side is the stamp, exit stamp, on the carnet. Custom officer will come now and uh, note the chassis number of our bikes just to make sure that uh, bike ex entering and exiting are the same. This is done to prevent smuggling of uh, expensive vehicle into and out of the country. So, my guys, the whole process is complete. Do you think I'll confirm it later? Sunil ji, now there is something left. No, it's all complete. Yes, it's all complete. Okay, it's all complete. But this is the first time in my life, so I'm getting a lot of fun. And I'm getting a new experience. Thank you, Peter. Yeah. Peter Parker, thank you. Thank you so much. I hope to enjoy the trip to Myanmar and I hope to see it again. It's an emotional moment. If it's not, then what's going on? I don't get to eat food at least. I don't get to eat food at all. Salim, are you ready to cross over? Yes. Second country? Yes, I'm excited. Oh. All right, so now immigration formality is done in Myanmar. Now we are crossing over to Thailand. Just across this bridge is Thailand and here we go. Keep left after traffic signal. This is no man's land. Whoa. Just after traffic signal, we are going to go on the left. This is crazy. <laughs> it's so amazing. And there is Sarhad Par. Uh, registration and we have to get the visa as well yeah yeah visa, visa, uh, yeah visa arrival yeah yeah okay, okay. i'm your tour guide yeah i'm sunil nice okay. to meet nice you to hi meet you. hi okay. hello okay. nice to meet you hi i'm Cham. Cham. he's our guide for my name is bo double bubble Cham bubble all the up here in thailand my tourist guide you have immigrated from uh, Oh. Thailand, I mean into Thailand now. Alright, so we have just successfully immigrated into Thailand with Salim Bai. Yes. And country number five officially for the ex Domina Dominar Great Asian Odyssey and country number two for Mohammed Salim Khan. Yes. Abhi Myanmar ke thappa lagane ke baad, yeah. aapne, uh, Thailand Thailand ke baad, uh, now the road will be substantially better. Yep. And in the next three days, we are going to do around two and a half thousand curves in the mountains so it means that the weather is also going to be very good you know, it's not going to be hot and sultry like it was in Myanmar Salim, are you looking forward to it? Yes, of course, why not? I have come to Thailand in the deep so I will take a fun to take Thailand and this is my first time in Thailand basically it's a different fun from the road we are taking fun here and uh, yeah let's take the gas to see the, all the Twist adventures the yeah. Yeah, we could run. Hello, Namaste, Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh. alaikum. This is Yawan Salim Khan, and this is Sandeep Gajar in Thailand with XBHP, the XBHP Dominar Great Asian Odyssey. Team so ki speed pe bola hai na? Eh? Team speed. Apna apna wo RPM zada hai na? Is amazing wali feeling ke saath ye amazing aur khush nama vlog ko samapt karte hain. Baaki sab badhiya hai. कल के दिन और ज़्यादा मज़ा आने वाला है कल वेदर अच्छा होगा रोड अच्छा होगा और सब कुछ नया होगा सब कुछ यानी कि रोड के साइन रोड का स्ट्रक्चर और लोग लोग थोड़े सिमिलर ही हैं बट मेरे लिए सब नया एक्सपीरियंस बहुत मज़ा आने वाला है यार